street R&B and hip-hop. In the recent digital release of his single, Rich, he speaks of his personal life in a wider spectrum. The hardships he experienced surely paved the way to where he is now. He shares more with us here on the show this morning. Uh, Cesar, good morning. Good morning, how are you? All right, man. Great. Always love hearing uh, new voices. You, you were so, part so of a much. band, and a lot of people remember you as part of a group called Too Fresh. Correct. Why the decision to go solo? Uh, uh, first of all, it's, it, it always goes down like this in, in, in when it comes to groups, you know. Uh, yeah. Different mindsets, different approach to different and things. Growth. And, and growth, definitely. So with me, it, it, was, it was a matter of trying to break away from the norm, mm. you know. Yes, there were issues, but not that it was personal things, but we were not yet mm. ready as a group, you know, mm. so we needed to take a break. Then I decided to go on and pursue the music because it lives in me, man. I couldn't just leave mm. it and, 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 and relax, yeah. So, so talk about this, this musical journey you're on, because when you're in a group, you're yeah. thinking as part of something. You always yeah. have to consider someone. Correct. Correct. When you're solo, everything rests on you. Yeah, and, and that's, that's the difficult thing, because... You, 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 you're surrounded by all these thoughts alone, no one to share them with. Mm. Um, so it all goes back down to you having a team behind you, you know, even though you are the main person, but have a marketing person, have a PR person that's going to share all these ideas with you, with you so that you can take them out as, as, as a company or as a business. You, know? mm. you shouldn't just be looked at as, oh, he's a singer or he's a writer, but there mm. should be business behind it. Yeah. Let's talk about writing because in Rich, yeah. you talk about hard, hardships and you're talking about yeah. what, it, what it takes, the hustle. You know, one thing about Josie, it is a hustle. This is yeah. this is where so, you know dreamers come and oh, they make the dreams happen. Oh, you know, talk yeah. to me about kind of the messages, the the stories behind the music. Okay, first of all, the one person that taught me how to write music as a singer was my, my late mom, who passed on in two thousand and five. Mm -hmm. She inspired me a lot when when it comes to writing the song, and obviously the birth of my son. You know, having to grow up without a a mother figure to, 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 to show you through the rope. So going into music, I had to find a way of expressing all of that. <clears throat> having a son at a very young age and obviously raising him and being there as a father and not having a father myself mm. to guide me. So, you know, when it comes to the hustling of the music, it, mm. it, 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 it's so painful to a point where sometimes you feel like giving up. But with me, I decided to take all the pain and put it into a song. And with Rich, obviously, I'm talking about my son. I'm talking about, you know, my partner just being involved in my music space, even though it's not easy for her to accept that I'm doing music. I'm not doing like a nine to five job, yeah. you know, so. It, it comes with its own. <clears throat> yeah, yeah, definitely. So I, I transfer all that pain into, into my music. So you've got different genres that right. you're blending. You've right. got soul, street R&B right. and hip hop. Right. It's almost kind of along the same line. Yeah. Many people yeah. argue that yeah. you can't yeah. have hip hop with elements of R&B. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Talk yeah. to me about the genre. Why were you attracted more to that? Because there are just so many different styles of, of, of hip hop and rap. Correct, rapper. correct. Look, hip hop is growing in South Africa right now. Mm. And for it you- It really is. It is, it is, it is. I mean, guys are filling up the dome and shout out to Casper to, 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 to for doing that. You know, he yeah. put hip hop on the map. People are making a living off exactly, of it Exactly, definitely. So for me, I had to come in a different way. You know, I'm a vocalist, I'm not a rapper. Mm. So being a vocalist, you're always exposed to your soul R&B, Luther Van Rose and, mm. and stuff like that. So I had to come up with Sizui, mm. you know, and that's a singer, an R singer like a vocalist singing on a hip hop beat. So hence I call it street R&B because of the lyrics as well. I, I'm, I'm from the hood, I'm from like Soweto, so mm. I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm fusing everything into, into, into one thing and that's why I call it street r and not just... But you've worked with AB Crazy, correct. Afro, Afro, Traction. Afro Traction, correct. Yeah, yeah. you worked with some big names. Or? Yeah, 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 definitely. And it was, it was an honor to work with those guys. I've learned a whole lot from them. And that was on my, in, my, in my time when I was too fresh. Mm. You know, we, we got to collaborate with AB Crazy, Lection, yeah. um, and, and, and Afro Traction, you know, and fusing all those things together, Caesar came out as well, like, yeah, that's it. When are we seeing the album? 
or are, what's the plan? Is it singles, music videos, <laughs> definitely, or is it albums? No, 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 definitely singles. We're dropping singles, expect more music videos, expect a video for, 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 for Rich, we're working on that currently, and expect follow-up singles and more music videos. Probably it'll build up to a mixtape or an album. We will see how, how it goes. Have to wait yeah. and see. Yeah, okay, cool. In the studio with us, our first music guest, he goes by the name of Tula Sizwe Sibeko, but his uh, artist name is Sizwe. He's uh, going to stay with us uh, for two more songs in the studio, and you can Google him. Find out where he's performing, and you can yeah. follow him on uh, Facebook and on Twitter. We take an ad break. Don't get away. Thank you. <laughs>